guys, Will here, just got back from the grocery store. I uh, bumped into Jimmy Wells and his wife Daph, and uh, it was great to meet a fellow plant-based eaters. Um, so hi to them, and they're from Windsor, Nova Scotia, and so we met in Amherst at the uh, Superstore, had a nice chat. I thought I'd go through some of the stuff that I got. I bought some uh, organic bananas. There's uh, three bunches of those. So I got three of those. I got tomatoes. These are organic as well. Cauliflower. That's for the cauliflower wings that I make, the bites. Really good with barbecue sauce and hot sauce. Oranges. These are organic as well, and these are onions. A couple of bunches of kale. That's good in soups and salad. Five bags, five three pound bags of these um, yellow potatoes, the yellow fleshed organic. No sodium added diced tomatoes, that's good for chili. Pasta. Extra chunky hot salsa, that's the president's choice. I have that with rice and beans a lot. Here's some red kidney beans for chili. More diced tomatoes in there. Here I've got some uh, organic celery hearts. This is great with the dip, the, the uh, tofu ranch dip that I have. Cucumber. Green and red peppers. Those are in um, spaghetti sauces and stir fries. Here's a big cabbage. I like those in my stir fries as well in soups, cabbage soup. A little more of the organic frozen strawberries for on my oatmeal mostly. I like these whole green beans. You just have them on the side of quartered potatoes. What do you think of that? Does it look good? Want some of Bunch of strawberries, I've got three bags of those. These are the um, banana pepper rings for the pizza. Hey, Kimo. You like that? They're, they're not that hot. It says hot, but they're not really that hot. This is a sweet Thai chili sauce that I put in the udon noodles. It's really, it gives it really an oily, if you like that, oily texture. It's not though, it's, um, it's just, you add that at the end of your stir fry. Caramelize it a bit, it's really good. Use some chives, put those in the in that tofu dip that I make. More oats. Rolled oats for my oatmeal. Tomato paste. That's in my pizza. I mix that with the um, crushed tomatoes and make a pasta sauce so it's a bit thicker. Or a chili as well, I think. More salsa. This is um, some unsweetened soy milk. Bonnie likes that. What do you think, you know? And this is some uh, maple syrup, 100% pure. That's for, I usually put that on the oatmeal. There's some recipes you can use when you bake things. You can use maple syrup instead of the typical oils and dairy products. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Lots of good stuff here. Oh, there's, um, I don't do this very often, but I, we don't get a lot of great fruit here. These are some uh, peach halves. Now they have some, uh, there's a light syrup, fruit juice. Actually peaches, water, concentrated fruit juice. So um, it's really good after they've been in the fridge and they're cold, they taste really good. So that's about it guys. I'll talk to you guys later. See ya.